YTPC. Beautiful, quiet, tranquil morning with no wind and a decent temperature. Lovely. And on such a lovely morning, I will pay tribute to our good friends, Steph and Skip. So I thought I'd also talk about some lovely things as well in this video. And I'm smoking one of them. This is a, a Mastercraft pipe, which is just like the one that um, Bing Crosby smoked a lot of Mastercraft pipes, he yeah, sponsored them. Uh, so you'll find kind of advertisements from the 1930s and 40s like this. So I made a few photographs that you can have a closer look at it, but it's really a, a lovely, beautifully restored pipe. I got this from um, Chuck Spiker, uh, who is on Etsy. I'll leave a link below. He has some really some lovely pipes and um, nicely restored. So it's a lovely pipe and um, back in the day, as you see from this little catalogue in the 1930s, you could buy a pipe like this for $2.50. This particular model is the popular one, which is uh, one of the less expensive ones. But even so, it's just a lovely pipe. Non-filtered of course, but I just used some crystals with it and I put a little uh, three millimeter paper filter in it. It did have a, um, a condenser mounted in it which I've removed because I, I don't really use those metal condensers. So that's one lovely thing that I got from Chuck and the other one was this uh, beautiful Weber pipe, which is this Zulu here. Now this has got a silver band and I was able to date this with the silver hallmark on the back which is from the UK 1943. So this is a, a wartime pipe from 1943. In fantastic condition and like the other one it's a sitter just flattened a little bit below that they can sit very nicely so there's a few photos of this that you can take a closer look of it I have researched these pipes a little bit and it seems that both Waver and Mastercraft used a lot of uh, pipe makers uh, abroad and they used uh, Hardcastle and, and some other pipe makers there uh, to supply them. 
got a radio going here with a little bit of Bing music to uh, of that period fitting with this takes you back to those days lovely romantic days I think in it today I'm smoking the last of my countryside I must order some bulk of this it was so lovely the lighter today is a Beretta solid silver got this many years ago fits with my some of my Beretta pistols put a gas insert in there lovely lighter Well, the highlight of this video remains Steph and Skip and I've made a little uh, poem to them and I've recorded that separately because all the noises and the bell ringers and the traffic and my neighbours there you go we'd interrupt it so with that, I end the video with a tribute to a great, wonderful, warm, cheerful couple that I try not to miss any of their live chats. Recently I've held back a bit because I don't want to help those trolls into these things, but when things have settled down, I shall surely, that will be the first live chat that I will visit again. So. Steph and Skip, this is my humble tribute to you and VR, to your gore. I uh, did do a little um, haiku, but um, that's not enough. So I made this little poem, and I hope you enjoy it, my dears, because I really do appreciate what you bring to YTPC and me. Take care. Bye-bye, everyone. To Steph and Skip Like Gemini, they are entwined, who converse and share one contented mind. They talk in happy, jovial tones that soothe and cheer our hearts and bones. The pillar of strength is he to her, both love and kindness he does confer. A joy of art and mirth is she to him, her creative mind, her cheerful grin. For us the most blessed soulmate pair are warming flames so very rare. We all share their humanity and harmony. God be thanked for Skip and Stephanie.